big break, Winona Earp, I was convinced that it was a mistake, adamant that I was going to be fired and sent back to England. I was completely tormented by the voices in my head that told me that, that punished me for not knowing certain things, told me that I was stupid, ugly, and never, ever, ever, ever enough. I believed that I had to wear certain clothes, do my makeup a certain way, and fit the sexy young actress box if I wanted to be loved and accepted. It's no surprise though, really, coming from a business that led me to believe that if I cut my hair, I would be less desirable and therefore less hireable. And I needed to cozy up to the producers and the people in power if I wanted to succeed. 2017, my mental health was at an all time low and I decided that I either needed to find a way to understand my demons more intimately so that I could work with them, or I needed to change career paths altogether. That was when I enrolled myself in a 10-day Vipassana meditation course, and everything changed. It was in Cambodia, I forgot to mention that. In that retreat, I was handed the key to my happiness but under one condition, I had to be the one to open the door. The following four years have been an unfolding into the unknown, coming face to face with my deepest fears and coming home to who I really am. Mm -hmm.